Alright, yo, what's good, y'all? It's Boy Younger here, back on another video. And today, as you read by the title and the um, and you saw in the thumbnail of this video, we're doing a sneaker collection video. So let's just hop right into this. So I'm gonna start off with a sneaker that not a lot of sneakerheads have, but in my opinion, it's definitely one of the best basketball shoes you can have, which is the Patrick Patrick Ewing shoes. I don't think these really do have a name, but literally these are one of the best basketball shoes to have. You see, it's got the extra ankle support. Uh, fat tongue, and when you tie, when you tie them up, you get the strap. You get the strap, put them on. Uh, so yeah, in my opinion, these are definitely one of the best basketball shoes you can have. And I got them in the next colorway to hold on. I got it in the next colorway to go with my, go with my Patrick Ewing jersey. So there we go. So yeah, if you're definitely if you're looking to get a good basketball shoe, I definitely recommend the ones. Next up on my beaters. So right here, these are just a normal Air Max. Right here, as you can see, they've been beat to the ground. Like you look right here, it's got that air bubble. And you look hold on. If you look right about you look right here, you can see the air bubble. This is about to pop. So that's that sucks. When that day comes, there'll totally be a video about that. Next up is another beater of mine, which is just your know which is your classic high top band or bands. I got a gray colorway. You see these ones are being beat to the ground too. So yeah, I do sometimes skate in these. So yeah. Next up, we're going with the sneakers that not a lot of people have. Yes, it is an Air Force One. It is a classic Air Force One, but it's not your white on white. It's your black on black. Now, these I do not wear all the time. I do not wear these. I do not wear these Air Force Ones all the time. I've actually only worn them once, and it was two when I had my chorus performance, and we had to wear all black shoes. So. I got the, I just got Air Classic, Black on Black, uh, Air Force One, which I do. It is a good shoe, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't wear it all the time. I just wear it to like if you're going to a wedding, or you're going to anything, a funeral, or anything like that. Black on Black, Air Force One. Next up are another pair of Air Maxes. Now these ones I just cleaned, so they don't have the laces in them right now. But these still need like one more good uh, wipe wipe down. But these ones are also trying are being beat. But I like them. They're good. They're good company. They got this Nike Air Max that I like. It reminds me of a '95 Air Max. And yeah, it's just all around a good shoe. So next up is the shoe that I actually got for Christmas. So it's a Nike SB. And I like it. It's a slip on. It's a slip on camo and black. Um, it's a slip on Nike SB. But I got it because it kind of reminds me of the slip on Vans. And I wanted to get a Nike. I wanted to get a Nike shoe or a Nike SB that um, that looks like a Vans, but it was a Nike shoe. So yeah, good shoe. All right. So next three shoes are shoes that are not actually mine. They're my dad's. But my dad and me both share them. So yeah. And the first shoe is the undefeated Air Max. Now this is a good shoe. It's a really comfortable shoe. Feels good on your feet. Hold on, let me move that out of the way. Uh, it's a really comfortable shoe. It looks really good with looks really good with anything. Uh, I mainly wear it with huh? Alright, sorry about that, but I mainly wear the undefeated with my DGK shirt that looks like the Gucci logo, but I like this shirt a lot, um, especially when you wear them with these, it looks really good, so. Next shoe I got is Supreme Shoe, and these are, I'm These are the Supreme 
Nike Air Max 2 Orange. This is a good shoe. Yeah, it looks good. Um, actually, I don't have the hat. My dad has the hat for these shoes right here. Uh, they look, they look really good. They feel really good. Um, yeah, it's just a really good shoe, and I like it supreme. Uh, if you look on the tips of the on the shoelace, it says "World well, Famous on it," which is really cool. Now, the last shoe that we're going in is definitely one of my favorite shoes. Let me just open that up. So, I'm just going to pull out one thing. That's this. Now, some people might know what this is just by looking at this. Now, we've got some laces. But these are the Sean Weatherspoon's Air Max 90s. These are definitely a flash shoe. Definitely, if you're trying to go, out, if you're trying to go out and try to ca catch people's attention, go with the '97 Shawn Wars boots. These are awesome, amazing. Um, I got mine with everything. I got my, I got mine with like I wasn't when I bought these. I got them with, or when my dad bought them, I got them with this dust bag and the extra and the laces. Obviously, it come with the laces. They came with a dust bag and everything. It was super cool. The box, the box looks cool. The inside of the box looks cool. It kind of reminds me of like a, kind of reminds me of like an off-white Virgil uh, Nike shoe, like the what's it called, like the on the off-white ones. So yeah, guys, that is gonna do it for this video. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, punch it. Oh wait. Never mind, there's actually one more shoe. Uh, my bad. Let me get that one more shoe. Okay, very last shoe. Now, this is a shoe that I've had for a long time. One of my favorites, and it is Jordan 1 Reds. These are the 2016 pair, which I really like them. It's got a nice, I like the bread and the black on them. It's definitely, it's definitely a really good shoe. If I wouldn't, I don't recommend these for hooping. I hoop, I hooped in these once, and I slipped and I fell, and I hurt myself bad. But I def I'd recommend these just if you're trying to go out and have like that hype beast look. So yeah. So yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, smash that like button, punch the notification bell in the face, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Peace.